The headline number sounds impressively horrible, 95% of AI projects failing, but what is more interesting to me is a few of the other numbers may be less reported. So of over a thousand enterprises across North America and Europe surveyed, 42% of companies abandoned most of their AI initiatives this year, which is a dramatic spike from the 17% that were abandoned in 2024. The average organization scrapped 46% of all AI proof of concepts before they even reached production. And the RAND Corporation reported the failure rate of AI projects is twice that of other technology projects like software and infrastructure tech. So first, what kinds of AI failures are we talking about? Well, here's at least a partial list. IBM Watson for Oncology. It was marketed as a transformative AI product for personalized cancer treatment, but it struggled with accuracy, frequently providing incorrect or unsafe recommendations due to a reliance on narrow and synthetic data. By 2023, IBM discontinued the product after spending billions, and major clients like MD Anderson abandoned the project making it one of the most notable and expensive AI failures in healthcare. Amazon launched an AI hiring tool, then they developed it internally as an AI system to automate resume screening for technical roles. The tool was abandoned in 2018 when it was discovered that the AI favored male candidates and systemically penalized resumes, including the words women's, reflecting bias in its training data and exposing the risks of unchecked AI in hiring decisions. And then let's not forget about GM's Cruise Autonomous Robotaxi that in 2023, one of their robotaxis dragged a pedestrian following a quote, perception failure, which resulted in severe backlash. And the incident led to the suspension of Cruise's robotaxi and a halt to what was one of GM's most ambitious AI deployments in autonomous vehicles. The UK government's AI-based passport photo checker misclassified a significant number of dark skinned faces, failing the critical fairness and accuracy tests and leading to public backlash and system adjustments.